Dear viewers, this is our second video on Swiss Online Target Prediction Tool and Online Molecular Docking. So today we will discuss that how we can retrieve our result. After submitting your docking, you will get notified like I am going to show you. You will get notified that your job has been submitted. Okay, here it has been notified and then after few hours or a day uh, depending on the uh, server available and the type of dog it will show you or it will give in, in a notification that your job has been terminated and you can check your uh, output file so you will open this and the output file can be retrieved from here if you click here we will get that our so this is our file Swiss doc file and it gives us that the result of our ligand with this kind of this protein we can also check the protein and ligand target interaction from here and uh, it gives full fitness score depending on this it is going in descending order like minus 143.99 143.453.90 3 so it gives in kilocalories per mole but it also estimates gives free binding energy of our ligand targeted direction which is in kilocalories per mole so if you look at here all these are the poses for our that single ligand so these are almost 255 poses and uh, we can download these file so download your prediction from here I have already downloaded it and we, or we can also use new CSF Chimera to visualize this binding after uh, downloading zip file we will open or we will extract our file like I have extracted this ligand file here so it will give us cluster doc cluster doc means all the uh, clusters of all the ligands are, are, uh, are all the poses will be present in a single file and uh, we will get a single pose like here one by one all these poses are present like it gives that uh, almost 255 seeds and here is our target protein so we can open this target protein we can open our this ligand and we can check and this is our complex so we can check ligand target prediction by using uh, DSV or uh, other softwares we can use or which are available like here I am going to show you uh, this is our this is our cyclic peptide I will show you later so these are the seeds like here seed 1 seed 0 seed 2 so it gives that uh, uh, how it will bind with the uh, our target so if we we can copy it and here I am going to paste here I have already pasted it so it gives that it will paste here so this it will be the first pose with our protein and then we can make ligand target interaction that I have already shown in my previous videos that how we can use ligand target interaction 3d models or how we can um, uh, produce 2d models by using DSV discovery studio visualizer and also I have uh, make a tutorial on chimera so then we can use this like here so we can uh, check these poses one by one or we can select all these by uh, taking cluster so so this one it is the cyclopeptide cyclic peptide so in my next video I will show you that how we can make a cyclic peptide in DSV discovery studio visualizer and uh, I have already checked this protein for uh, target prediction so this it will be our second example that how we can predict our target so for this cyclopeptide I have predicted the target it gives target classes it gives that uh, which target it is going to act these are the common name of these targets uniprot id campbell id we can search all these like uniprot id i can search that what is the kind of this target and uh, what are the inhibitors of for these and uh, these are the classes of the proteins like membrane receptors kinases oxid probability and the non-similar ligands for our compound and these these will be the active compounds which are either 2d or 3d models against these targets and uh, we can download this pdf 
uh, format or Excel format like I have sh I, I'm going to show you that I have already downloaded so this is our file Swiss target prediction so uh, these are the alt targets so we can download it like here it shows that almost 376 2d files for beta secretase which is proteases and similarly membrane receptors 120 these are the membrane receptors and it is also going to target G protein coupled receptors and membrane receptors so 146 G protein coupled receptor that is so in this way we can uh, find our target so in the next video I will show you that uh, uh, some other tools which can be used for online target prediction and molecular docking and then we will move to our desktop softwares which, which can be used for docking studies so uh, if you like my video please subscribe my channel and share uh, for upcoming videos and notification for upcoming videos you may press the bell icon and then you will be notified thanks